With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello friends, so in this question they are asking, explain the terms monoadelphus, diadelphus and polyadelphus. In each case, name a flower, flower position such as androsium. So, let's understand the male part or androsium. So, this is filament of stamen or androsium and this is anther of androsium. So, this is diagram of androsium which is a male part or male flower male part of flower so in this condition androsium are present in different ways so first condition so first condition is monoadelphus monoadelphus where so in this monoadelphus condition filaments filaments of a stamen fuse with flower to form one group A good example of monoadelphus is China rose or hibiscus. And second term is given diadelphus. Di means two. Adelphus condition is used for stamen. So in this condition, filaments are fused. Filaments are fused with flower to form two groups. Example is pea flower. Third is given. polyadelphus condition poly means many so in this condition filaments are fused fused with flower to form more than two groups more than two groups. Good example of polyadelphus is Bombex plant. So terms monoadelphus, diadelphus and polyadelphus are types of stamens and examples are China rose and Bombex plants. So, hope this clear. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.